Hey YouTube, it's me! So I am wrapping my new hat that says Bride on it from Tulala that I just unboxed, the vi unboxed, unboxed it and go check it out. I'm uploading it now, so don't check it now, but check in a few. Um, but now I'm going to be doing my 209th wedding series video. So I have a small envelope that has my name on it with my address and it says, I want to start off with this, and it says, blissful i don't know what it says Blif blissful events so i was like that's definitely wedding related if it says blissful so i want to un unopen i mean I'll open this and see what this is all about so it says oh blissful events oh oh it's wedding planning so we don't use wedding, we don't have to use a wedding planner because we're almost done. But they gave me their information. So if anybody's looking for a wedding planner, here is the information. Oh, sorry for the glare. There, no more glare. And then here is that. It's, that's the name of the person, Raquel. And then there's your services. So they have... Full service, wedding planning, and then partial, and then day of coordination. So yeah. So anyways, that's just advertisement. But anyways, I have a package here. And it's quite big. So I looked at the label. And again, it says David's Bridal. So I don't know if you guys remember whoever watches my previous blogs but uh if you do not and this is your first blog yes i'm getting married i'm getting married on august 10th of 2019 um and i'm so excited so that's like what eight nine months away so i already got my wedding dress i bought my wedding dress um well i have two wedding dresses i have one from kleinfeld and then one from david's so the david's one it's a whole long story but the david's one is now my original my Walking down the aisle dress, and then the one from Kleinfeld, I will try to make it into a different party dress if they allow me to. Um, but there was a whole mix up with my dress. I got my dress in the mail with nothing in it, and then I had gotten another dress a day or two later that was completely done. Like my whole dress was there, the inside. My dress is pretty big, so it's like it's poofy. Um, if you guys don't know what dress I am talking about, I will show you a picture of my wedding dress. I'm not going to bring the box because the box is ridiculously big. Um, but, um, I bought that dress from David's Bridal and it was happily missing, like, the whole inside. So the whole ruffle, the reason why I like the dress is because the ruffling is a unique ruffling. So, now that I have... The dress well I have a shell from the first shipment and then the second shipment I have the real dress so I have everything twice so then from the previous one with the sh with the regular with the shell I had ordered a penny coat so the penny coat was not inside the box so I my, as you could still remember I went into David's bridal and Explained it to them and said, you know, I got a package, but it was no bottom to it. It was like the top and the just the the just the front part, the top, the the what you call it? I cannot talk today. What you call this? The bodice, and then there was a um a like two layers of the bottom ruffles, where it's supposed to be like so many layers. So I'm gonna show you a picture of it, and then um. I went to David's bridal and just talked to them and I told them that there's something wrong with the dress and then they gave, sent me, two days later they sent me a totally new dress with everything else like another veil, another tiara, another blusher, another, another um, um, what you call it, belt. So now when I went back there I told them, because when I initially ordered it I wanted to have a penny coat which makes it a little bit more poofier. So now that I finally got my dress completed, oh FYI, David's bridal is going bankrupt. I cannot believe it. Like they have, they are going bankruptcy. 
I mean, like, that's crazy. Like, a lot of the brides love David's bridal because it's affordable. But anyways, I'm glad I have my dress just in case they do close. I have my dress. I don't have to worry about it. So, they forgot my petticoat in my initial order. They forgot the pen penny coat in the second order. So, they finally send me a penny coat. Is it penny coat or petty coat? I call it penny coat, but I don't know. So, if you guys don't remember, refreshing your memory, this is my beautiful wedding. This is my beautiful wedding dress. That's not a good picture. Wait. Alright, this is the last picture. So, that's my wedding dress. So, it's really gorgeous. Um, It is a ball gown. So, they forgot my whole petticoat. So, the petticoat is the thing that goes underneath to make the dress all poofy. Even though my dress is poofy, it needs the structure. For it to be having structure like this. As you can see, it's very hard to see in this picture. Let me see if I can make it darker so you guys can see the detail. But for it to have the structure, I need a petticoat. And, ooh, this smells. And I have, ooh, it smells like mothballs. I have my I have my ball gown slip in a large. So this needs to air out. So I mean let's see if there's a way that I can take it out of the plastic and still put it back into the plastic. So this is just underneath, so it doesn't matter if it gets a little dirty. This is going to be underneath, but it needs to get aired out because it smells like pure mothballs. So this is the penny coat. Oh, they give me a plastic too, which is cool. So this goes inside. Ooh, stink. So this is the penny coat. This is what it looks like. So you put this part in the waist. And then it makes it more poofy. So when I have my dress on, I don't know if you guys can see, but it's going to be like so. So I'll have my girdle, like a special, like, Spanx probably. Trust me, don't worry. I'm going to have some Spanx because I have to suck this in. And then this one. So I have to let this air out because it's so it smells like mothballs. But yeah, and then inside it has like more layers of tool. So I think it's inside out. Is it inside out? Yeah, it's inside out. So I'm gonna leave it inside out. So the outside will have the tool part, which is this part. I don't know if you guys can see that guy. Mm. It will have this part, and then on the inside where my skin touches.